Showing what happens to animals for food, clothing and entertainment. Oh, cool. Yeah, have you seen videos like this before? No. No? What do you think of it? I haven't watched it for very long. But... Okay. Do you want to come a little closer to see it? More. Keep your distance? Yeah. yeah. Oh, is it when they kill the things for food? When they kill animals yeah, for food? Yeah, kill animals for food, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Have you seen footage like this before? Yeah, I don't like it. It's not nice, is it? No. Yeah. It's cool. You don't care thanks. about them? No, I do, I do. <laughs> I do, but thank you for caring about them more than I do. Okay. So you found the videos, so yeah. it's good. Do you care about them? Um, I care about human beings the most, you know, like, um, yeah, I do care about animals and I don't think it's right if they don't treat animals properly. Mm -hmm. so, do you think you can care about human beings and animals? Yeah, yeah, I think you can. do can. both? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. 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 So, what do you think about the footage? It's pretty gruesome, but I mean, they're, they were, they were made to be, like, back, woo, I, I don't even know how long ago. These were made to eat, like. What were made? Pigs, cows, well, they were, for years and years and years, we just, that's, that's what, what we had food. Yeah. Do you think that we need to eat them now, in 2019? Yeah, why, what's the difference between 2017, 2016, 2015? There's no difference, yeah, really. No, yeah. I don't know if you're talking about, like, many thousands of years ago when we needed to for survival, or if you mean right now. Do you know what it's about? Well, I'd say it's about um, caged eggs and caged chickens and farmed pigs. Not I just, don't know, are you Peter? We're not Peter. No, the group's synonymous for the voiceless. Um, it's not just cage, we're showing what happens to animals so we can eat them on coming from all different kinds of farms. So a lot of this is free range, organic, cage free, etc. RSPCA approved. What's, where is this all, all this happening in Australia? This is actually all Australian footage, but it's the same thing all around the world because it's the same uh, standard industry practice yeah. in every country. So I could take footage from Europe, from America, from Asia, mix it all up, and you wouldn't know the difference. It's the same thing that's been done to animals. It's big, big business, is it? Absolutely. Absolutely. The only reason they're doing this is because it's big business. It makes a lot of dollars. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it's only protein. It's meat. Yeah, it's Sorry? Protein. protein. Yeah. Okay. Do you think we can get protein from other sources other than animals? I reckon, but they have the strongest amount of protein. Okay. Have, we have, have, have one of the strongest amount of protein to yeah. you know? What exactly? Like, like, like pigs and steak and all steak, that. Steak's good, steak's, steak's good. good Why is it good for you? Protein. And do you think you can get protein from other sources I mean, though? yeah, but... So if you can get it from other sources, why do we need to eat animals? What's specifically in animals that we need to eat them for? There is good protein, meat, meat's tasty. I mean... Well, if, if tasty you... is different from needing protein though. Well... We oh, you're really for there. everyone, are you? Sorry? You're really for all the animals. Yeah, yeah. We're just looking at um, how we exploit animals for food, for clothing, for yeah. entertainment. You'll see something different on each of the screens. And we're asking people tonight as consumers, first question is, have you seen it? Do you know what you're paying for and contributing to? Yeah. And the second question is, if, if you don't think it's a good thing, would you consider changing your choices? This is pretty full on, isn't it? Those yeah, see that one? Eggs. Yeah. That's sad. Sad? That is. So, like, how do they get the, the shells? Mm -hmm. Just a practical thing here. Yeah. They're chewing up shells and little chickens. Uh huh. And how do they separate the meat, the feathers, the ah, shells? Okay, so you don't know why that's happening. No, why okay, do they do that? That's for the egg industry. Okay. Now, they are baby male chicks. They've just been hatched. Yeah. And because they are useless to the industry, to the egg industry, they don't lay eggs, of course, and they're not going to grow big enough, fast enough for meat. Yes. So they are just killed on their first day of birth. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, that's they are like... <laughs> Isn't it? That's crazy. Mm-hmm. Some of those plants have children. All right, just think think about that. Oh, Some of them have children. No, I, mean, I, I think you're a little more no, intelligent than that. No, no, you're not. What you're talking about there, we had that app where you're showing the little the phone over the uh -huh. egg, egg yeah. carton uh, and you can yeah. see how how just some of eggs. the eggs live. Right, or right. How the chickens live, actually. Yeah, yeah. And we always be free range, but right. we still don't know sometimes what well, free range Well, a lot of what you're seeing how. is free range, in yeah. fact, and what that app won't show you is two things. It won't show you what happens to the baby male chicks, which I can show you. Very important that you see. Well, you're about to miss it. Right here, baby male chicks, they've just hatched. This is the egg industry. Wow. 
Because they're no good. They're no good. They don't produce yeah. eggs. So this is free range, organic, cage free, everything that your app is scanning. Yeah. It's not showing you. So we kill billions of baby male chicks every year Jeez, because crazy. they don't make the industry money. As you said at the beginning, it's a it's big business. Wow. Yeah. I think yep. we should all maybe just have a few chickens in our backyard. And... Well, you know, people do. It's not just a matter of how we're treating the animals. It's looking at animals differently. So what we're talking about tonight is the fact that do we need to use animals at all? Do they have their own lives and their own purpose? Are they here for us? Are they here with us? Oh, you're a vegetarian. No, oh, no, really? I'm vegan. vegan. Because a vegetarian would still eat eggs. And so ah. when I was vegetarian, <laughs> I was still paying for those baby male chicks to be ground up. Oh, okay. Right? Yeah. So I stopped eating meat yeah. because I didn't want to kill animals. Yeah. But I didn't know about the egg industry and the dairy industry is just as bad. Really? Have you actually had a close up look of it? I don't think I want to because I've seen it too many times. And yeah, that, that's you're okay with splitting throats and yeah yeah you're yeah. okay with that have you done it yourself have you been in a slaughterhouse oh i mean like i get like yes or no no why not <laughs> why do i want to go to slaughterhouse why do i pay money to travel yeah. to watch things get killed when, when, when i can watch it say here here for free well it's not a matter of why would you watch it if you think there's nothing wrong with it if it doesn't scare you where it's easy to say that through distance through a screen I mean, but do I you think if you were there with the animals that it might be a different story for you maybe yeah but and yeah. all of the egg laying hens, no matter what farms they come from, they're all slaughtered for meat at the end of well, when they're spent, when their egg why, production why do you not declines. Think that's okay, though? Why do you think it is okay? Because I just think it is, because they're just animals. Just animals? Yeah. Apparently it's very good for you to stay away from animal products. It is actually, yeah. It's good for your body, yeah. It I is was, good I was for our body. An article on it. Mm -hmm. so, so you know what's good for our bodies? Very healthy. Yeah, so, well science is telling us a, a <laughs> whole foods plant-based diet is um, helping to prevent and reverse You're a lot a of whole our, foods person. A lot of our leading causes of death. Yes, I try to focus mainly on whole food. Can I ask are you left wing or right wing? What does that mean? Like oh, don't worry, don't worry. I was just wondering it if has you're no, left wing. No, I mean, it, it has nothing. It seems like you're to... left wing. Why would you say that? Because most vegan people that, I mean, say if you are vegan, wouldn't you go to that tree there and take off some leaves and just... Is that what you think vegans eat? Do you think you have to be left wing to be against slitting throats? Oh, I mean, most left wings would be, yeah. Right, so if I had a dog here right now and I took a knife and slit his throat, does oh, that make no, me left wing? no, because dogs are meant to be pets. Oh. Dogs are pets. Where did you learn pigs that from? Pets. Where did you learn that from? Um, they've, they've, they've been man's best friend for so many years. Okay. And then those pigs are not man's best friend. What are Cows they? Cows are not man's best friend. What They're are food. they? They're meant to be... They're food? Food. Yeah. I, I've got, yeah, I'm not an animal person, so... Do you think you have to be an animal person to look at this and say, is it right or wrong? I don't think that that's necessarily the right way to do it, but I know that obviously yeah, if like it's it. a money making thing that's what they're going to do yeah do you know why it's a money making thing though because people want it yeah because us the consumers are paying for it so if we didn't have the demand if we didn't give the industry the demand then they wouldn't produce it is this about um making people sort of directing them towards veganism or? yes it is yeah we're trying you. thank you <laughs> we're doing it. and the reason why we're doing it is because consumers don't know so you eat eggs right um yeah yeah, yeah. so you're paying for that what you just saw the baby male chicks being ground up but when you saw that your face was like oh this is really bad and so all of us i me included before i watched this footage i was paying for this i was eating this and i didn't know okay so if i had a if i had a piglet right here then yeah and i took a knife yeah and i started to stab that piglet yeah do you know what would happen what It'd scream well, it would scream yeah but, but everybody else around me would be absolutely horrified and they'd call the police and I'd be arrested for doing that and yeah, people would be horrified. Ah, so if we do it behind closed doors it's okay? Well, I mean, yeah. Why? I reckon I just... It's just... It's better for everyone else. It's better for everyone else? Do you think it's better for the animals if it's done well, behind no, I closed get, doors? I get but how do, you, how do you ever get, you know, the right, like, on the right level of that? You know, you, we can say, oh, well, we will only buy, you know, ethically killed stuff and you're saying there isn't any. That's right. So you're just saying yeah. you have to be a vegetarian? No. This is the egg industry, remember? So You've got to be vegan. Correct. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
exactly. What if well, what if I had the chicken at my house? Then you'd probably say to me, the health benefits aren't good to me. They're not good to you. And also, um, the thing is, are you talking about chicken uh, eggs specifically? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Say, say I have my own eggs. Sure. Would you so be okay with that? I wouldn't because um, egg-laying hens they will naturally produce about 17 eggs a year. Now, what we have done to them is we have selectively bred them to produce about 300 eggs a year, which is very taxing on their bodies. It's kind of like having a period 300 times a year, right? Yeah. right? And so that leaches a lot of calcium from I their don't bones. Know what that feels like. It doesn't feel good. <laughs> I, I can feel, tell you. I feel like that was, that was your argument for a female. Well, you I'm sure you've had a female partner in your yeah, life yeah, at yeah, some yeah. point, or a sister, or a mother <laughs> yeah, who yeah, has, yeah. you know, yeah, I've it's, seen it. it's I've not seen awesome it. fun. Yeah. So the point is to go through that 300 times a year not great very taxing on their bodies now what happens is when we take their eggs they produce more so even if they're around you know hens at home that we have in a lovely environment the more eggs we take the more they produce like pigs the way that they're slaughtered is terrible why the way, just how they're grinded up no 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 the way they're slaughtered how are they slaughtered any differently from any other animal I don't know how to explain it, but it's like... All animals are slaughtered in the exact same way. They're either stunned first with pigs, they're put in a gas chamber, yeah. and then they're rendered unconscious. That doesn't always happen. Then they're hung upside down by the leg and they have their throat slit. And a lot of the times they are still conscious when they're bleeding out. So it's the same process for all animals. Yeah. I don't. And the point is, if I was to do that right here, everybody would be screaming in absolute horror and I'd be arrested. Yes. But if we do it behind closed doors in a slaughterhouse, which is a house of slaughter, yeah. all of a sudden that becomes legal and guys like you can watch the screens from a distance and say, yeah, I'm okay with that. It's what the animals were put here for. That's what they were put here for. Who told you that? Obviously, that's what we've been passed down Obviously, for. Oh my that's God, what you, Yeah, that's years. what you've been taught. But you don't think that animals have their own purpose? I mean, it's a choice yes, that we're making as consumers, but we have to be aware that we're either paying for this or we're not. Yeah. Right? So, do you think that we need to eat animals? Is it a necessity? Yeah, well, some I do, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I like eating meat. So you like it, yeah. 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 So there's a difference between liking something and needing something. Do we need to do it for What's anything? Like cheesecake? Well, I like cheesecake yeah. too. No, you don't need it. Yeah. Well, I do eat it. Have you had it for breakfast? I can, I can have it all the time. I have the vegan version. Yeah. See, we're still eating the same things. Yeah. And then we don't stop eating those products because we don't yeah. like the taste of it. We stop doing it because, um, to me, this is wrong and I don't want to pay for it and I don't want to put it in my body and I don't think it's okay to do it to others. The other thing is, I like to always say this to people. People say, well, you know, they just lay the egg and what are you going to do with it? Like, it's just sitting there. And I say, you know what? Just because something falls out of a hen's butt doesn't mean we've got to do something with it. She's producing eggs from her body. That's what she does. That's not their us to take. What happens is when people start eating backyard eggs, it starts to normalize this uh, opinion that we have that animals are here for us to use. That somehow we can just take what we like from their bodies and then it becomes a slippery slope. So you go out to a restaurant and you order something with egg, but all of a sudden you're paying for that. Yeah. The eggs at the restaurant don't come from your backyard hens. Yeah, right. I, mean, I mean, obviously, it's not okay for them to be slaughtered, but it's like they, it's food. Does it have Any to be food. food? Does it have to be food? Can you eat anything else besides animals? Well, oh, yes, but like, they're your main source of protein. Do you need protein from animals though? That, going back to my first yes, question. Yes, they're your main source. Why? Who told you that? Uh, are you a bodybuilder? No. Our protein requirements are actually quite small compared to what the meat industry tells us. Protein is actually in all plant foods. Yeah. If you're eating, you're getting enough protein. So we have vegan bodybuilders, we have vegan athletes, yeah, obviously. There's nothing wrong with being, I'm not saying there's anything wrong with being vegan. Yes, yeah, so the like point that. is that you don't need to eat animals for protein, is the point of it. You were asking earlier on, you know, like, is there, basically is there a better way of doing this? Yeah. The question would be, if it was us, if this was happening to, to me, is there a better way for someone else to slip my throat? I don't think so. I wouldn't want someone to slip my throat at all. I know, but it's, I know, <laughs> right? but you... Oh. Uh, it's really hard to explain, or like for me to explain what I think. Would you ever consider not eating animals? Uh, what would be holding I, you back? I would do it for the health benefits. Yep. Um, but, you know, I don't actually, I'm not too worried about eating red meat. Uh, actually, 
I know it's not healthy for me, mm -hmm. but every now and then. Okay. I, so, like I'm, I'm, I'm okay with eating it. Right. So, my question would be, have you seen the footage where they're slitting the animal's throat? I know that's going to be pretty tough, but they've got to kill it somehow, you know. Well, they don't have to kill it if we're not eating it. So, they're only killing the animals because <laughs> we're creating the demand mm. for, the, for the meat. Yeah, right. Okay, so this is only happening because consumers want the products. Yeah. If we reduce or eliminate our demand, that violence will also be eliminated. And these animals wouldn't be bred into existence in the billions in the first place. Yeah, but then people who transfer from non-vegan to vegan usually get really sick and really get really skinny and Really? Yeah, really. Yes. Wow, yeah. who told you that? I've well, seen it. I've seen, I've seen it firsthand. I've seen it with my yeah. Friend, friends. My friends. Wow. Like Alice. Okay. Yeah. So there are many different ways to eat a vegan diet and there are many different what reasons that people go to a vegan diet. Some people yep. decide to eat a plant-based diet yeah, because they want to lose weight and they do it in a really unhealthy way. That's not the same case for everybody at all. In fact, if you look at what science is telling us, 14 of the 15 leading causes of our death are scientifically linked to eating animal products. Really? That's right. I would be really enlightened to see those facts. I would love I to see those facts. I would love to give you those facts. Heart disease, some types of cancer, type 2 diabetes, they're all linked to, to animal products. They're not linked to plants. In fact, a plant-based diet based on whole plant foods is what uh, science is using to prevent those diseases and in many cases reverse them. You care a lot for animals. Well, it's not that I, it's not about caring for animals. It's, it's about, good. it's about looking at this and saying, is it right it's or wrong? Good. No, I, I think it's a really good thing because you've got a really caring heart. It's good. People don't I, have it these days, you know? I think when people see it, I think it changes their mind and their hearts. They oh, have to see yeah. it. Yeah, seeing a traumatized animal is You know? The thing is, like, for example, I might not care about all humans, but that doesn't mean I can go around and kill them. So we don't have to yes. care about someone not to hurt them. We know that violence is wrong yeah. and it's unnecessary. It's not about caring or loving animals. It's just about knowing that we don't need to do it. If you want to learn more about the health stuff, nutrition I facts. I think I I think I want to. No, no. You just said you wanted to learn the science. No, you wanted to I learn the facts. I want you to see, show me the facts now. Well, here's a link. You're going to have to, uh, what do you want me to do? Uh, you can't go on you, some, to that one link? One of you vegan people have created that link and I, I, I want to see it from a scientific website. This is not a vegan website, mate. This is science. Okay, have you got a phone? Uh, yeah, but I'm not pulling that out to waste my charge on that website. Okay, so you're going to you're gonna continue paying for the slaughter of animals, eating food, eating food that is... I don't pay taxes. Is... I don't pay taxes. Are you just talking about taxes? No, I said you you're... said paying for this, so I assume you meant taxes paying for this. No, you're paying for these products. You're paying for meat and dairy and eggs. Is that what you're eating? Yeah. 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 So you're paying for animals to have their throat slit. You're putting dangerous things into your body that's contributing to our leading causes of death, but you won't click on a link to educate yourself. No. You no. think that's closed-minded? Not really, no. Not really? Yeah, yeah. Yeah? Mm. But it's levels. Everything's levels. Yeah. Everything in society is levels. Yeah. People, animals, whatever. Oh, I understand. It's not, we're not saying that animals are the same as humans. Yeah. All we're saying is that we all have the equal ability to suffer. And if we don't yeah. need to cause that suffering, then why would we want to do that? Yeah. It's a tough one. Why is it tough? Thank you for your time. I've got to go. I've, you have to go? I've got a 7 o'clock appointment. I've, I've enjoyed this conversation. You've done really good. Thank you. You've done great to listen. Uh, Can I leave you with a card with some more yeah, resources? Give me a card because I'm going to okay. tell my housemates because we, we do appreciate what you're talking about. Okay, so we've got some videos here. How does it make you feel to hear yourself say these things? How old are you guys? 16. 16. Wow, you've got the rest of your life ahead of you and you won't even click on a link that will change your life and oh, potentially save your life. For example, if I had a dog here right now and I said, you know what, in my part of the world, we yeah, eat yeah. dogs yeah, yeah. Yeah. and they're tasty. I know. We are do you know what I mean? And if I took a knife now, you'd be horrified. You'd say, oh my yeah, gosh, yeah. you crazy woman, please don't do that. Yeah. Yeah. Even if I had a chicken or a piglet here, you'd do the same thing. Yeah, yeah, but because it's from a distance... You don't see it. Sorry? You don't want to you see don't it. See it. Exactly. Yeah. 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 That, top, <laughs> that top one there... This is going to be funny, yeah, because we're going to watch some of these and we're just going to start hating me. Well, you know what? It's about hating what you're paying for that's unnecessary. Yeah. It's, hurting, it's hurting our bodies, it's hurting the animals, it's hurting the environment. That top one there is what turned me vegan seven and a half years ago. Still strong. Absolutely. If you want to give it a go... What's it, what's it done for your health? Oh, good stuff. Yeah, yeah definitely. Yeah. How, yeah. how are you going? Like, are you feeling like more of a jump in your step or what? Yeah, look, there are many different ways to eat a vegan diet. So you can eat a junk food diet vegan. and you can, yeah, you can feel like... 
right. You can eat a whole foods, predominantly whole foods diet the way I do. I like that. I would do that. It's great. What if you were the victim? What if someone was slitting your That's throat? That's completely different. This, Why? We are humans. We are not Why? meant to be killed. These are animals that are meant to be killed for food. That's a completely Why is that completely humans different? Humans and animals are different. They are different, yeah, see, but in, see, our, different. in our ability to suffer, we are the same. Yes, but... And if somebody came along and said, you know what, you look like a good source of protein, I might just slit your throat. Yes, and then... Would you want somebody to look into some resources like that? that would save your life? Well, then they get in jail for killing their own species. Yeah, you know, what upsets me is the sheep going overseas. How they the live eaten. exports, yeah. yeah, yeah. I hate all that stuff. And a lot of people do. And yeah. then I, we say to them, yes, that's bad, but we do the same thing to those animals in this country. Mm. We're still doing the same things. Yeah. How do you eat out with your mates? Easy. There's vegan stuff everywhere these days. It's 2019. Also, I'll show you a resource. There's an app. Give me the card back. It's 2019. It's 2019, mate. It's 2019. All right, this one here, happycow.net. It's an app that you download on your phone. It's a restaurant directory. So anywhere you are in the world, I've traveled the world as a vegan for seven and a half years. I can find somewhere to eat anywhere. Down the road, there's a great vegan place called Grass Fed. You can get burgers with vegan cheese and vegan bacon and vegan egg. What if it was another species that came to this planet and we were theirs. We were property under the law for them to own us and do whatever they wanted well then, to us. Well, then, if some people fly it, down from... Done. And that would be all right with yep, you? Yeah, sure. That's done. done. That's yeah. done. That's done. done. We've, we've, you think it's easy to say that from a distance? You think it's easy to say that when you're not in that situation and the knife's not slit to, sitting in your throat? Because it won't happen. And they all want their food fresh over there, which is sad, but, oh. you know, it's all about the farmers and what yeah. they want, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. But that's right. They're going to make some money, but it's sad. Well, they, they can make money doing treated. something different, yeah, you know? Industries have changed throughout history. Yeah, we changing, um, exactly, we have to evolve. Yeah. Um, you know, once upon a time. You think we will, though. Of course. Ever? Do you? Well, you have to. Well, no, it's not about me, whether I'm thinking about it. Well, I look at it very logically and from a practical sense. I look at the economy actually, and what we're finding is that businesses are investing in plant-based foods not because of ethics, but simply because of money. So uh, the magazine, The Economist and Forbes magazine, they said 2019 is the year of veganism. Now they're not a vegan establishment by a long shot, but they're simply looking at investments. Uh, Tyson Foods is the largest meat producer in America. They have just announced they're making vegan meat and vegan dairy. Right, okay. because there's a demand. So I don't look. At, I don't think it's going to change because I need it for hope for myself or for, for our movement. I see what the industry is responding to, and the demand is huge. What do you do when you're not preaching about veganism? I'm not preaching. I'm educating. No, 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 no. no. It's good. It's good. I was just stirring you up. But what do you I do? I live a normal life. Like, what's your occupation? Like, I'm, I'm not like stalking, but you're an yeah. interesting person. Yeah. So, like, when you're not, you're very passionate about this. Mm -hmm. But what actually pays your bills? Um, I am a, a vegan educator. Really? Uh, yeah. Is this your is this your whole campaign? Are this, you, are no. You this? No, I'm not. But this is actually. Is a, that your husband over there? It is. Yours? It is actually. <laughs> <laughs> Smile, you're on vegan camera. Oh my gosh. I thought to myself, I thought to myself a minute ago, I thought that's probably a bloody husband over there, like video camera right now. But you know what? These conversations are absolutely golden. Did you meet him like five years ago? No, like, I met like, him. cornered some bloke over there and just go, mate, I've changed where your freaking head's at. And look, now he's like, we met in you. primary school. Oh, there you oh, go. And we've been together 21 story. years. It's a beautiful story. It is a beautiful Jeez. story. And you know what, Martin, is even stronger? When we watched that first speech that I mentioned on the card and we both looked at each other and said, you know what? What we've been doing our whole lives is wrong and it's unnecessary and we've got to stop it. Yeah. And that's it. Yeah. So, you know, once upon a time, we had black people who were property of white people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah. No, 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 hold on. It does have something to do with it. That's We're all humans. We're from yes. the same yes. species. Yes. But black people were once treated just like animals. But white people used to say, black people are not actually humans. They're a different species. You, you mean black that, people? Yeah, white people would say that black people. You, you said white people would say that white people. Oh, white, you, you messed your words up. You're done. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. You've lost. Goodbye. <laughs> Little <laughs> <shits. Yeah. laughs> Oh. I can get on a flight virtually anywhere these days and have a vegan meal on board. You couldn't do that five, yeah. ten years ago, but now it's you can. easy. We've got a bliss ball coming up here. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Never seen that right. before. Yeah, it's changing. So that's yeah, that's good what. On you. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Yeah, we'll think it. about yeah. it. Will you? Yeah. 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 Do you have any questions left? Is there anything that I can fill in the gaps? 
if you like. I don't know. I think it's. I think it'd be. I mean, it's distressing seeing that. Yeah. It's distressing. But, you know, it's easy not to look at it. It is. And that's what yeah. happens. You see it on Facebook. You just scroll through. Yeah. You know. And yeah, it's I don't upsetting, want to see it. Basically. Isn't yeah. It? yeah. And, and we have to ask ourselves. Like yeah. If it's upsetting and we don't want to see it and we scroll past it, yeah. then that means there's something wrong with it. So if yeah. we can't look at it, why are we eating it? No, if there was, it's tasty, so it comes back to taste. So if you could eat something that's equally as tasty, that didn't cause that violence, well, that, that didn't involve an animal at all, why wouldn't we make that choice? And what, what happens if you slip up? What happens if you, if you, if you, know you eat, eat an egg? Well, mistakes... Are you legalistic about it? Oh, let me answer one question at a time. An egg in let me answer one question at a time. Mistakes are proof that you're trying. Yeah. Okay, so sometimes there'll be something in your, in your meal that you've ordered out and you've checked and you've said, please, I'm vegan, don't put these things in, and it comes out and it's still got bloody cheese. Yeah. And you go, you know what, that's a stuff up. I would send it back and let them know I'm not going to eat it. They need to be aware that that's not okay. Yeah. And that's how you change things. Cool. You've got to learn how to read a few labels. But the more you stick to whole foods, it's easy. Now, I still have the same diet as you. I still eat burgers. I still have milk. I still have cheese. I still have everything ice cream i've got ice cream in my fridge but they're all coming from plants instead of animals mm. there's a restaurant seven minutes that way over the bridge called grass fed it's a new vegan place and you can get a burger there with a patty that tastes just like beef they call it beef <laughs> beef it has a vegan egg it has vegan bacon you can have ice cream yeah it's called uh, grass fed we will, go, we will go there tomorrow and have a look at it. So, yeah, you know, yeah. I'm just letting you know that you can have the yeah. same diet yeah. made from plants in terms of taste, if that's what's, you know, yeah. holding you to animals. So. Yeah. Well, right. you've done a very good job. Thank you. Keep on going. And I would love Keep on for you, thank you, to try one thing for me. Give me that card back. You keep putting it away. Yeah, right. <laughs> Here, vegan22.com yeah. is a 22-day vegan challenge. Oh, get out. <laughs> right? get it's out. totally free. You sign up online. I reckon we could do it. I reckon anyone could do it for 22 days. You Why? could do it with your housemates. Well, see, like I'm a Christian, right? Yep. I'm about to go to church. Okay. My friends fast. Yep. Um, and they do a vegetable fast for uh, a month each year. Yeah. Like just to get themselves more spiritually connected to God, right? Yep. I'll leave you with a card if I can. Yeah, yeah good on you Some... for having a go at it. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you for, for listening and having the conversation. That's why I wonder what it was. Yeah, so, and we should wonder. Yeah. We should yeah, we ask should. the questions, yeah. right? So yeah. on this side, you've got more documentaries about the ethics, but also what it's doing to our health and the environment. So you're Christian, you said. Yeah, Okay, yeah, yeah, so yeah. there is something amazing that I'd love to share with oh, you. Oh, here we go. No, <laughs> exactly. Jesus um, didn't eat the meat, hey? No, no, no. Well, there's one question to ask is, what would Jesus say to something like this, right? Um, now, there's actually a campaign at the moment. We're trying to get the Pope to go vegan for Lent. Crikey. And job. yes, in exchange, this organization is offering, offering $1 million that he can donate to any uh, charity that he wishes. Oh, okay. Hey, you're on mic. Hey. Man, this whole conversation's on mic. How funny is that? And your husband's listening to it. Yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> Did you oh, hear a thing I Look, said? If we go famous, yeah. I want some money for this, all right? If we go famous, I want you to go vegan. I want money for this, all right? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go to church. Okay. God bless you. Thank you're, you, mate. You're awesome. Cool. Look after yourself. Do you, when you say church, did you go to the church here? Uh, there's a church down there. They don't have mass. Yeah, time. yeah. There's a mass on now. Now. Yeah, down down here. Oh, you mean the Saint Stephen? It's the Hillsong one, just down there. Yeah. All right. So remember the question to ask. What would Jesus say? What would Jesus say? She said it, guys. All right. Peace. Oh. Vegan22.com, it's a free online vegan challenge for 22 days. Okay. You sign up, costs you nothing. They give you a mentor to answer any questions. They give you recipes. You give it we a go for that. 22 days. We Your taste it. buds change as well. Yeah, and then you won't want it. Same as eating chocolate, not eating chocolate. Yeah, you yeah. crave what you eat daily. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Thanks, guys. Lovely to meet you, too. Have a good night. You too. Bye-bye.